So I have a friend of mine, she's notorious for getting fleeced when she goes to a shop to have work done on her car, whether it be, you know, necessary repairs that she's overcharged for, in my opinion, or little maintenance upsells that she probably doesn't need, and with a little know-how, she could save herself a ton of money. Um, perfect example of that are these cabin air filters, like this 2010 Jeep Liberty is equipped with. And I'm going to show you how to change these today. There's two filter elements for this Jeep Liberty. Uh, I let one of them go about a year and a half, just so you can see how dirty they get. And the other one's about six months old or 12,000 miles, which is right at the point where Jeep says you're supposed to change them, which is 12,000 miles. So let's go ahead and get these out. And even if you don't have tools, you know, you're not super mechanically inclined, don't worry about it. This is pretty hard to screw up. So you just open up the glove box and take the side walls to the glove box here and you're just gonna lift up on the glove box, push these in and let it fall down like so. Now you'll be able to access the compartment where the filter is held. So with the glove box out of the way, you can see the compartment that houses the filter elements and there's a little locking tab on each side. You just pry that tab out of the way and open the door. Door just flips down, you can see the filter element in there. You don't need to be super concerned about getting this element out without tearing it if you're going to replace it anyway. Uh, in my case, I'm just using a little piece of mechanics wire with a hook on the end of it. I find that works best. You could probably use a coat hanger too. So I'm just going to stick this thing in there, pull this element out. This is the uh, six month old element. The other one's the old one and it's probably nice and crusty. Come on. Six month old filter, year and a half, maybe two year old filter, I don't remember. It's pretty well roached as you can see. Uh, this one's an AC Delco. I got a two pack of these for $11.65 on Amazon. I don't remember what I paid for this one, but I think I got it at my local auto parts store. You can see this slightly different. The Delco filter has a tighter pleat than this guy over here. Both of them have done decent job of collecting uh, you know impurities in the air this one's this one's packed full as you can imagine I'm not going to take you guys along for the reinstall it's really simple it's just a reverse of what we've already done just one thing to keep in mind regardless of the filter you buy I'm not sure if you can see that they do have directional arrows on them showing which way goes down same thing with this with this filter here airflow down just for ha-has, I'll show you one of the new Delco filters compared to the old six-month-old Delco filter. Look at the difference. So I appreciate you guys watching. We'll see you next time.